What's going on everyone? It's time for Feature Friday. I'm Bobby. You know all of that. Let's jump into the feature. So this week we're going to be talking about a new option that was added that allows you to redirect people from the online customer profile to a place of your choosing. A lot of people have asked for ways to disable the portal and we don't really have, or at least I should say we haven't had a way to deactivate the customer portal in a true sense, but this is one way that you can definitely achieve that. So what the heck am I talking about? Well, if you're new and you don't know what the online customer profile is, whenever you create a customer and repair shopper, uh, the online profile is created automatically for them. And it, by default in a every template really, there is a link to the online profile for the customer to click on in the footer of the email. You can also go to the customer detail and click on customer online profile and it will take you to a dashboard of sorts that will list open tickets, invoices, estimates, all that good stuff. We've done videos on this and we have plenty of documentation on this as well. Go check it out in the knowledge base if you want to know more about the profile. But this week we're talking about what if instead of people being able to go to the profile, you wanted to maybe redirect them to, oh, I don't know, maybe your business website. Maybe you have a custom widget where they can submit requests that end up in leads or automatically create tickets. Instead of them going to the online profile, you could direct them there. So to do that, head to admin and then customer preferences. Next, click advanced and you'll see a new field here called disable customer portal and redirect to the URL, uh, URL below. So I'm gonna just type in Google here. Uh, I also want to show how you need to enter data into this field just to make sure everyone's on the same page. If I were to click save right now, I'm gonna get an error. Uh, that's because we require you to enter in HTTP or HTTPS uh, for the URL in this case, of course. I'll just plug that in here, hit save. And now that I've done that, let's go check out a customer profile. And now if I click this, it should take me to Google. In this case, it, it worked. If I wanted to turn that off, I could of course return to the customer settings and then remove that and then if I wanted to go back to the online profile it'll let me it's this is uh, for folks interested in maybe completely disabling the portal you can just redirect any portal access to your what your business website or any website of your choosing and then of course remember to remove the links to the footers if that's what you wanted to remove so just to recap we've added the ability for you to redirect the online customer profile link to a URL of your choosing. To get to that feature, all you need to do is go to admin, go to the customer preferences, click advanced, and then there is a new field here where you can enter in the URL you want to redirect to, and then of course hit save. That's all you gotta do. I hope everyone enjoys this. Please give the video a like if you liked it. Uh, think about subscribing maybe if you're interested in this kind of content. And as always, I'll see you next week.